twisting a towel as if they're trying to wring water out of it. So what we've done right now is we've worked along the coronal suture, down the mid-sagittal suture, and now we're going to work along the temporal bone, right along from the edge of the eye, down the side of the head, and back. So again, I'm using my fingers, my thumbs, to apply a little bit of pressure as if I'm trying to pull the suture apart. Now each of these areas of the brain is responsible for various activities. For instance, the frontal lobe of the brain is responsible for how we think, if we're motivated, it helps us to decide what's funny or sad. The frontal lobe of the brain decides what's right or wrong. It's what we call the executive functions. It's what makes us different from other animals. This frontal lobe of the brain, like I said, helps us decide what's right or wrong, what's funny or sad, if you're a survivor or if you're somebody that's just been picked on all your life. So these are the types of things that, that the frontal lobe makes decisions on those types of things. As we're working on the skull plates to get this movement back in, this very slight movement, we're actually increasing blood flow. Now sometimes when I'm working along these skull plates, we will actually have patients tell me that they can feel things all the way down in their legs, sensations. Everybody's a little different. Some people are not going to be that sensitive, and others will. So now what we've just done is we're finishing up, working along the temporal bone, again with my, my fingers. So we worked along the frontal, the, along the frontal bone here, the coronal suture, the mid-sagittal, the temporal, and now I'm going to work on the other side. We'll do the same thing there, and then we'll be finished. Thank you.